Everybody just look around at each other. Look around at each other. I want you guys to realize that together we stand. Together we are one. When we put stuff together and we come together as a family, this is what you get. This reunion is not about nobody but this family. This is more so for the young folks, so we giving y'all a, bl a blueprint on how to continue the legacy of one of the most important women in our lives. That's Grandma, that's Grandma Dolly and her husband Joseph. This is how we do it. This is how we want to continue to do it. Together as a family, we can accomplish so much. So much we can accomplish if we just stick together. Love is the key. Well, I want to call my sister up here because I want my sister and everybody to know that together we are a force. Come on, come on, come on. We are, come on, because a, a lot of times when you have younger siblings, they feel as though they may not be as important. My sister is so important to me. I want her up here. I want her to know that she matters. I love her. I will always love her. But this message right here is about my mom. And... One thing I can say about Jeanette is that she refused to allow her children to become a statistic. She worked hard, tirelessly, 40 years on her feet to make sure that we didn't have to want for anything. She moved us out of the project. She wanted to show us a better life. She always led by example. My mama held two jobs sometimes to help take care of us. Well, that's my pink dad, over that crying. My dad, who's always been a strong example to me of how to get up in the morning and go to work continuously every day. My mom, although she ruled with an iron fist as well, because she did not take not, no Yeah, that's right. Here and she I is. I have bruises today to show you. Anybody want to see this, come take a look at it. But I, I, want, I want my mom to understand that right now it seems like it's home. Right now. But I love the love that her children are putting forth to help it's unmeasurable. We will do anything and everything that it takes in order to continue to support her, love her, and make her life easy now because that's what it's about. Her sitting down and letting us do the work now. And I love her for putting that commitment in us to continue to do that. I'm not going to take up too much more time because we have been taking a lot of time. So I want to, I want to leave you guys with this. I want to leave you guys with this. The key to any successful family, the key to any successful family, your family is the strong, is the weakest link in your family. So it will be our job to make sure that that person is lifted up, make sure that that family is lifted up so that we can all share in this happiness together. So I love you, I love all of my ATs. There's a lot of memories that of course we can go on. But I'm, gonna I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, let me leave you with this. Tiffany, Jalinda, thank you, my friend, Desiree, you guys are, are, are by far, by far, the greatest family members one could ever ask for. We have each other, it's Sharan, 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 Sharan as well. But I want, I want, the reason why I'm saying that, the reason why I'm saying that is because I want you guys to understand that. Just as well as this reunion happened, everything, any tragedy, we can all stick together. We can all survive. We can all be successful. So I love you guys. Thank you. And would you like to say anything, Ramu? Well, I don't call her that. Um, I just want to say that I just love everybody. It's okay. I'm free spirit and love and peace to everybody. I'm so glad we had we having this right now, this day. And, uh, oh, know, that's Panky over there crying. I miss my Auntie Wanky. I miss my Auntie Little Me, my mood. That's where I got my nickname from. You know, and I'm just, I'm just happy to see all y'all here. Uh, thank you. Next to our mic is Tiffany Hurd.